literally in the corner. Hi guys, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. <laughs> I don't even care the location it's like 12 oh no it's actually way past that it's 107 um but I do want to get this haul out I went shopping a couple weeks ago and I got so many cute things and I wanted to do a haul and I filmed it but I'm such a perfectionist I filmed it like eight times and none of the cuts I liked so I didn't even post the haul but this time I'm not even just, I'm just not even gonna care. Like, I just don't care. I just wanna get a haul out. I like watching hauls. Um, yeah, so I'm just gonna do one. Also, I wanna apologize. My intros are always super weird. I hate intros. I don't know how to make intros. They make me feel really awkward. And I think in the future, a lot of my videos are just gonna be like some sort of like colored screen, like in typing. Like there won't be a video for like an intro. It'll be like, typing like i just i don't like doing intros so i again apologize for this horrible intro and for this awful look because ooh, ew but i did want to get this haul out so let's get on with the video okay so first i'm going to share what i got from the moa because that's where we went to first so first we went to victoria's secret and i got this mini fragrance and it smells good I sprayed it on and it's really strong, but it's perfect for like the car. Um, I'm taking my driver's test in like... <laughs> Why did I have to think about that? Okay, anyways, I'm thinking, I mean, I'm, I'm not gonna tell you what I'm thinking. Um, I take my test in 14, nope, not 14 days. I take, my brain is all mixed up because I thought of one thing. Um, I'm taking my test August 14th. So I'm super excited about that. Hopefully I will get a, hopefully I'll get my license um, that day. You know, hopefully I pass the test is what I'm saying. Um, anyways, main point, I got this for my car. That's, oh my gosh, I told you guys this video is gonna be a mess. Okay, next we got this sticker and I got it for my hydro. It says love and life in Minnesota because we do love life in Minnesota, kinda. Um, but yeah, so I think it's super cute. You know how freaking long, um, I've been trying to get this white back off this so that it can be an actual sticker since the second I got it and I still can't get it. Anyways, moving on. Um, the last place we went to at the Mall of America was Lulu. So I did order some Lulu shorts a couple months ago and I ordered a zero, I think, and they came in and they were way too small. So I went in and got a two and these are actually different kind of shorts than I got when I ordered them online, but I think they're cuter and I like them better and I like how they fit better. Um, they're the hottie hot shorts, they're four inches. So I got these. And then I got this white headband. So I just thought this would be perfect to like have in my bag and then bring to cheer. And like if I need to like throw my hair back in this, then I can. So that's what I got from the Mall of America. Um, kind of a smaller haul, but everything I got was kind of expensive. The Mall of America had like no sales like at all. So um, I got definitely a lot more stuff at the outlet just because they had a lot more sales. So now onto the outlet. Okay, so the first place we went to in the outlet was Coach. So the first thing I got was this wristlet. I think it's so cute. I have three of these now. I have a black one with iridescent, and then I have like a hot pink, and now I have like this cream white. I think it's so pretty with like the gold Coach thing on it. Um, I really like these. I don't use purses. I would never use a purse. So I really like these because they kind of carry anything I need. They usually fit my phone. I get a new phone every year. So it really depends on the phone size. But usually they can fit my phone. And then obviously like my money and then like my permit or like school ID or whatever I need. So these are kind of all I like to get from Coach. And then this year I got this thing. It's like a card holder. Um but like lanyard-ish, kinda, I don't know. Um, I have a lanyard from, what's it called, Vera, and I really like the lanyard, um, and I wanted to get kind of a bigger one so I could hold cash in this one. What am I even talking about? Like, I don't, this isn't even making any sense. 
I just wanted this to put on like my lanyard for like my car, like with like the keys, you know? And I wanted to, I don't even know what I'm talking about. What am I talking about? Like, I'm seriously confusing myself. Like none of this is making sense. Like, oh my God, I'm so tired. Okay, anyways, I wanted to get this to put on my lanyard, which is from Vera. It's not this one. And I wanted to like, it's like the one with like the keys on it. You know what I'm talking about? Like, because I had one of these on it I had like a wristlet from Coach on it, but it's so big and like it doesn't need to be that big. So like I got one of these to like attached to the lanyard and it's like what am I even talking about? Like I'm confusing myself. Like I feel like I'm okay. Anyways, I got one of these. Okay, so I got quite a few things from Vera, as you can tell. Um obviously I am really loving this uh pattern. I got a patterned makeup bag, obviously, that's what Vera's known for, um, with this pattern on it during Christmas time, and I really, 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 really like it, and it kind of just, like, fits me, so I got a backpack, I have a Kankin, um, that's what I used last year for last school year, and it fit nothing in it, I love my Kankin so much but if it's nothing so I got this Vera one because I think it's super cute and it could probably fit a lot more stuff than my Kinkin can so a bigger binder and like my pencil pouch and everything so I got a backpack and then I got this duffel it's the large duffel and my friend Aubrey has this and she brings it to sleepovers and it looks awesome because it just like holds so much stuff and I would actually prefer like a duffel over a suitcase um, and I do lots of traveling, but I don't think I would ever really bring like a big suitcase. I just like duffels. I think they're easy. I think you can throw stuff in here and they fit so much. So I got this really big duffel and then the duffel actually came with the blanket and you could kind of like mix and match, but I decided to get the same pattern and I'm so happy I did. And it's so so soft like okay i can fall asleep like right now which like honestly kind of sounds good because i'm like really freaking exhausted okay why am i getting comfortable this longer okay i cannot go to bed in a corner so anyways that's what i got from vera and the last thing i got was from lucky the lucky brand and like if no literally i know I know okay hang on okay so um at TJ Maxx or Marshall's I can't remember they have this one brand and it's called the lucky brand and it's kind of peaking a little bit it's starting to get up there and they have really good jeans I found one pair of their jeans at Marshall's and TJ Maxx and I would just like to say I know I know someday soon these jeans are gonna go viral and everyone's gonna love them and everyone's gonna hype them up. The same thing with freaking Personal by Harvey. Or like whatever the frick his name is, I don't care. I I hate these bands. That's what I was gonna say. I hate those. Those where did it go? Okay. Anyways, um the personal song by Harvey, you know, the one that everyone loves and whatever. Okay, I bought that song the day it came out, and that was my jam. Like, what year did it come out? Like, 2016? 2017? I don't know, but I know the day that I got it. It came out December 1st, some like 2016 or something. So I'm just saying, I know this brand is going to go hype one day, and I just want to let you guys know, I was a part of this hype before it was a thing. Like, I... I'm a trendsetter. Like, I know this is going to go hype in, like, maybe a year. I went to the Lucky brand store. I didn't even know they had a store at the Egan Allen Mall. If I did, I would have gone there a long, long, long time ago. Because the one pair of jeans I have from them, from TJ Maxx or Marshalls, I can't remember, is so freaking cute and so good. And it fits me so nice and, like, my favorite pair of jeans. So, I got two pairs of shorts from there. I got this black pair. Um, I don't have a ton of jean shorts, and I definitely needed some. So, this was highly needed, and they were, like, so cheap. So, I got this um, black pair. They're just, I don't know. One thing I like about these that I don't really like about, like, American Eagle or, like, 
Abercrombie and Fitch, and I'm sure you can find ones that aren't, but I feel like every time I go to those sort of places, all their shorts are super cheeky and like your butt is like popping out and these are like not like that at all. And then I got this second pair. It's just like a regular denim. It has a ton of cute buttons on it. Um, yeah, look at it. It's so freaking cute. It says Lucky You on it. That's so cute. Like, what the heck? That's so cute. That's so, like, Pinteresty. And, like, the back of it is so cute. Anyways, so I got two pairs of shorts. And then I thought these were mom jeans, but they're actually not. They're very different. I don't even know. Ethnetic series. I don't know if that's what they're called. Um... I don't know they fit really different but i love them i think they're so cute and i don't know they just have these like really cute rips in them and again they have the lucky you thing in here um these sadly did not fit me right um so we are going to go to the store and just exchange them for a different size because the guy said that we could do that since we couldn't try them on at the store um because of stupid covid but anyways so i am going to go back to tomorrow and return these and get a bit of a bigger size i think these are like double zeros so i think i'm gonna get a zero i don't even need to size up in this but my mom was like yes you do so i don't know if i'll size up in this or not because these fit me okay but i guess they looked tight in my butt so maybe that's not a bad thing you know anyways so that was my haul um it was kind of a crappy video and i'm really tired so that made it even more crappy video but I hope you guys enjoyed and if you guys did don't forget to give it a big thumbs up and subscribe to my channel and stay tuned for more awesome videos like this because you know all my videos are really crappy like this and are really funny and super entertaining and yeah I'm gonna go to bed I'm super delusional and really tired so I will talk to you guys I was about to say tomorrow, but, like, that's probably not accurate. So, I will talk to you guys, or see you guys, in my next video. Okay, anyways, bye.